Hi guys, I am back with a solution to a question, which has been asked by a user. So, let's start. If you haven't subscribed yet, then please subscribe. As I understood, he wants to add another option in, the toolbar of the component. So before, we start, I am going to remove the code, which we added in our last video. I am only going to remove trigger from component selected event. There is two way of doing this. We can using the component selected event. So, let's create an object of our required toolbar. First key is icon. I am going to use square plus, but you can use any icon, which you want. Second option is title. Let's create default toolbar variable and store current toolbar of the selected component by using method get toolbar. I am going to find out that our component toolbar already has new toolbar or not. Let filter the toolbar option using command, which we want to perform on the click. if we already have the command. Then we are not going to add it twice. If not then let's add our option. You can add the new option in the last or first. I am going to add the option in starting. For that I am going to use unshift method for the same. After this, let's set this updated toolbar back to our component. Now, let add our missing value it and command. Also let's define our command and its functionality.
I am not going to add much functionality in this, just print some message to check it get triggered. You can define your own functionality as you like. Now, add this command to our toolbar. Let's add some console logs, and check it how it goes. This should be find instead of filter. Now, let's see a quick demo. As you can see we have our fifth option in our components toolbar. When we click on this, we can see out message in console. If you learn something from this video, please hit like. There is one more way to add toolbar. if you only want an option for any specific component like, image, audio, table etc. Let's go to any component definition where you want to add the option and create a toolbar list which we want to add I am going to add default option. And then our option with, command, or definition. I am not going to show demo for this because I have disabled the Tailwind component. But hopefully this will work on your component. See you in next video. Be safe and keep learning.